He's down. All right, finally out of that tree. Let's go get hands on this deer. Yes. All right, he went down right here. Just 30 yards from the stand.
Oh my God. Look at that dude. Look at that. <laughs> oh my gosh, my biggest deer, hands down. Oh, so glad I decided to move in late evening. Over here, hunt the field. Hoping to catch him coming in. Never had an idea. I was actually going to settle for that small eight point that was coming in. Because I had no idea who could find anything of size. But lo and behold, held out a little bit and it paid off. Fantastic. Oh, fantastic. Hey guys, this is Ray Skinner. I just got out here muscle loader season out in Mangum. Was blessed by one of our family members, the Gerald, let us hunt out in his property. And this morning went out and saw a small eight point and that's about all I saw. So I was pretty, uh, pretty broken hearted, pretty broken hearted this morning. <laughs> and uh, sorry, all the adrenaline, pretty broken hearted this morning. And so decided this evening that we're gonna leave tomorrow. I need some meat for the freezer. So I was gonna, if I saw that little eight point again, I, I was gonna take him. It was pretty much a done deal. I moved the stand, set up on the edge of the field, knew where they were gonna come through um, from where they came from in the morning, assuming. The small four corn came out and I knew the eight point was with them early in the morning, so I waited and the eight point popped out and I, I got all excited for the eight point thing and shoot, at least gonna have meat for the freezer. And then lo and behold, I see a big body deer coming out behind them and that's when this guy stepped out and they were probably two, 300 yards away and so, waited and waited and I, I lost him for a while it probably took what seemed like forever to me it was probably realistically only five ten minutes they got lost him in a draw I had no idea where they were coming out and then right to the point where I was sitting there thinking maybe I need to get out of the stand cut them off head out to the field get to him before it gets too dark they, they popped up over the ridge I mean coming on right to me and <laughs> uh, pulled up the shot and missed the first shot clean didn't even touch him just made him jump didn't scare him too bad they didn't run off they actually kept coming towards me so i fumbled for a while digging for primer and reloading the gun and what my first shot was probably about a 90 yard shot and then by the time i got reloaded and everything else they were 40 50 yards away and well the second shot wasn't as bad as the first shot needless to say and so he he ran probably 10 feet and just fell right over and so really, really happy. This is definitely my biggest buck. Um, it's just a, it's a, it's a huge thrill and I'm blessed to be doing this stuff and hunting out in the outdoors and have family let us hunting their property every once in a while. Uh, really, 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 really happy right now. So uh, thank you guys for watching and see you next time.